Dirty Old Man here doing another video. And today I decided to talk about this YouTube online community. Specifically the gaming community. Now I'm in my 40s and uh, some might say I'm too old to be playing video games, but whatever. So I've been on YouTube and uh, I remember years ago people would just post gameplay, give their opinion of games. Uh, just talk about uh, what's coming out, what they want to come out, you know, what's what's disappointing or what they're surprised with. But but nowadays that that's all gone. That's all gone. All this gaming community has turned into is a bunch of beef. That's all it is. It's a bunch of beef. You get your uh, one side, which is your Xbox people. You get your other side, which is the PlayStation people, and never the twain shall meet. Of course, you get your Wii U uh, weirdos on the side there, but we're not going to talk about them. So, you get these two camps, and what do they talk about? Do they, uh, what do they spend most of their time talking about? Sure, sometimes they play some gameplay, sometimes they, they'll even talk about a game or even give a review, but most of the time... They're beefing with somebody else because they didn't agree with them. We hear people going back and forth saying, you know, I'm going to kick your ass if I meet you in real life. Why? Why? First of all, you're not going to kick anybody's ass in real life. You're not going to travel to Florida or Philadelphia or Chicago or anywhere else to go kick somebody's ass there's a lot of internet tough guys here they post videos about each other insulting sometimes they insult their families their kids it's a bunch of grown men getting on podcasts challenging other grown men to come in there so they can uh, settle their beef so to speak and if the uh verbal part of the beef gets too heated or too amped up then you get some people going to say they're going to call the cops I've heard that some people say that I'm going to go and uh, what's your address so I can go kick your ass in real life is this really what's come down to then you know what don't even bother calling yourself a video game channel or anything like that just, just get on and say you know who am I beefing with today what kind of internet drama am I going to do today that's all it is a bunch of grown men acting like a bunch of tough guys threatening to do bodily harm to each other sometimes it gets so bad they'll even look your ass up don't put your name on the internet hell why don't I put my my face on the internet because there's a bunch of weirdos out there that just all they do they, they, they're going to search you they're going to they're find you and when somebody got to beef with you, they're going to post your your information, your name, your address, you know, any any criminal record you have. It's gotten ridiculous. A bunch of internet tough guys. What else are you going to do? When you beef with all the people you're beefing with, what's next? You can't go back to the other shit because you know what? Most of the people that subscribe to your channel, that you subscribe for the drama. They ain't subscribe because you're playing The Last of Us or, or Halo or uh, Call of Duty or Grand Theft Auto. They're not, they're not, they not—they don't want to see that shit. They want to get on your channel to see what kind of drama will entertain them today, and I think they know that. But guess what? After a while, that drama's going to play out. How many times can A tell B and B tell A that they mama sucks, you suck dick, you're a faggot, I'm going to kick your ass when I see you. I'm going to kill you. Here's your real name on the internet. Then what? What are you going to do then? What's left? Stop being a bunch of keyboard warriors. Stop threatening people. And do what you wanted to do initially on your channel.
this is going to stop one way or the other. Either you guys stop it yourselves, or the people just get bored of it and they move on. Well, anyway, this dirty old man. That's it for today. But as always, go with God, but please do come back.